Hi and uh, welcome back to my channel. So um, I'm going to do a short summary of my last week and that is something that I'm going to continue to do hopefully every week. Uh, the uh, last week has been uh, kind of tough for me. I have had some uh, serious fatigue going on and uh, I have been so so tired and I came home from my interrail journey yesterday which was by the way totally worth it and uh, I think that is part of the reason why I have been so so tired and you know maybe it has drained a lot of energy for me even though it was totally worth it but uh, since I came home, I, I I have just been sleeping, but I have also experienced a little bit of uh, memory loss the last couple of days, and uh, that is usually not something that I do experience. So that's is probably because uh, it has been a lot of tempo in my life the last couple of weekends, and. You know, I basically traveled down from southern Italy up to Sweden uh, with a very high tempo and uh, maybe that they did have some impact on my brain. Uh, I have also had a little bit of headache, not that much, but uh, it, it has been constantly been there. Uh, it's, really not something that had bothered me that much because I'm very used to headaches and I'm used to headaches that are way more worse than this uh, but it's annoying and uh, something else that I also want to mention is that I have experienced the last couple of weeks um, something that is new to me and that is a bit of a leg twitching uh, before before I go to sleep it's but it's not the same when you, you know you have some kind of leg twitching when you are about to fall asleep this is something that can go on uh, for hours before that it's not something that that is hurtful I can just feel that my muscles in my in my um especially in my left leg it has been twitching a, uh, a little bit and uh, i have read about that and that can possibly be a saying a sign of um, a cerebrospinal fluid leak or um, that my my uh, pressure is is low in my brain uh, I'm going to uh, continue to monitor that and uh, I'm going to reach out to my neurologist if that is something that is getting worse or is continuing to be a problem for me. Other than that I haven't experienced any other neurological symptoms that is out of the ordinary for me. And uh, it could possibly be that my pressure is starting to normalize itself within my brain because uh, I have been on medication for almost a year now, for 10 months I think it is, and uh, uh, my pressure has gone down around my optic nerves every time I've been at the, the doctor. Oh my, I'm so tired, sorry. This is like how I feel all day, just tired. And yeah, we were speaking about um, uh, my uh, pressure. Yeah, uh, it could be a low pressure symptom, but I don't know when I'm going to continue to monitor that and uh, the pressure has gone down around my optic nerves every time when I've been at the doctor and uh, I haven't been 
seeing my eye doctor for um, a couple of months now, so it's possible that it's about to normalize itself. But we will see about that when uh, I visit my my uh, eye doctor the, the next time. And uh, with that said, I think I'm going to stop talking now and uh, see you in the next one. Bye.